He looks like a surfer or maybe a rock star, but Blake Cook is actually a preacher, spreading God's message at 200 miles an hour. God's given me the opportunity to race in NASCAR, and, and I feel like, and I know as a Christian, I have to give back by living out my Christianity. Blake lives out his Christianity in the fast lane of the nationwide NASCAR series in the 81 Daystar car. He got behind the wheel after racing motorcycles for about nine years. He says motocross was just too dangerous. I was getting hurt a lot, so I decided, you know, around uh, 18 years old, I decided to get out of motocross and go to college. And then I had an opportunity to get in a race car at the amateur level. I did, and I was hooked. I have fought the good fight. And faith-based sponsors like Daystar and GodSpeaks.com were hooked by his testimony and the giant stage he could use to reach people for God. Being able to talk to people about my faith and my relationship has just really strengthened it. Every time Blake gets into the car, he says a little prayer, and I don't blame him, especially when the wall is coming at him at about 200 miles an hour. And he says in moments of crisis, he believes God was with him inside the car. There's so many situations during the race where you almost get in a wreck and you do get hit and you're safe and you're protected and, and maybe you're spinning out and you keep going straight miraculously somehow. So I mean, you definitely feel, as a believer, I know those are close connections to God. I know it's God all over my race car. And Blake thinks he's got a little advantage because who really wants to hit God's car? Driver Eric Holmes did it in 2009. And after the race, his wife's like, we're so worried that we don't know what's going to happen. We might go to hell. We just took out the God car.